Greetings gastronauts, this is Keith Cooks, I'm Keith and today no pinny again, I'm not cooking again. I've got a bit of an announcement. I'm going to tell you about my new YouTube channel. Da, da, da. So if you saw the prequel to this video, which was about subtitles and uh, captions and things, you might have noticed that I was sat here with this little pile of electronic gizmos um, beside me and then made no reference to it whatsoever. <laughs> So I'm sorry about that, I, I realise it's it's a bit cruel to do things like that, but um, I had fully intended to include this segment in with the first video, but my trusty old microphone um, had a total meltdown and the audio was un unintelligible and I didn't have a backup, silly me. So this is an old, old microphone and I hope it'll work. Uh, I've got a new one on offer, but it's uh, coming from China, I think, on some kind of mule. So it'll be a week or two before it arrives. Anyway, the new channel is not entirely a new channel. It's an old one, rebranded for the third time. This channel started life as Keith Talks and it was just me standing there talking about whatever took my fancy. But it did kind of rely on me being in a good mood. And for most of last year, I was kind of depressed because of, you know, the political situation and stuff with my dad and things like that. Anyway, so Keith Talks became Keith Mumbles and then Keith sits in the corner sulking. So yeah, I knocked it on the head and transformed it into Keith Makes because um, I'd started doing a lot of woodwork and DIY stuff and I thought those would be good topics for a channel. Um, and I'm not wrong. But also I had a good long think about what I actually want to do on the channel and it's expanded to include uh, electronics, Arduino, 3D printing, um, road trips, travel, you know, pretty much anything except gardening and embroidery because Mrs. Keith Cooks does that. <laughs> so with that expanded range of topics or strands, um, the name Keith Makes really wasn't appropriate. It didn't suggest the range of things that I might be doing. So about a month ago, I made a video on Keith makes, as it was, uh, asking for suggestions for new name. And um, thanks to everybody who responded, there was a lot of great suggestions there. But in the best tradition of Boating at Boatface, I uh, have decided to ignore all of those and come up with my own name, which is this. So here we are on Planet Keith, and you know, as a designer, when when you launch something, you've got to have a logo. And I actually spent a week doing that animation. And having seen it, I've now kind of decided I like the name, but the animation it's it's too slick, it's too uh, you know sci-fi, especially with that fanfare background music. So I'll quite likely change it again. However, I'm not going to let that stop me from getting on with the actual channel content. I've already got half a dozen videos in the can and I've finished the editing on some of them. They just need the branding dropping in and then we can get started. So just a little tease of what I'm going to be doing. I made a picture frame from some upcycled oak floorboards. I've started a mini series of software tutorials focused on DaVinci Resolve 12.5, which is the software that I use for editing my videos. And it's brilliant. It's a professional standard chunk of software. And that version 12.5 is not the latest version, but it's very, very capable and it's free, but it's a bit of a learning curve. So the series is aimed at People, you know, like I was six months ago, never used it before, didn't know where to start. And all the available tutorials online, my goodness, those people are professionals. They know exactly what they're talking about, but they're not professional presenters or educators. And so it's just, 
you know, over your head. What happened there? What did you do there? What did you press? Um, so in mine, I'll be a bit more plodding and explain things a bit better, I hope. Okay, and I've got another woodwork project, which I uh, hinted at when I did the um, tool storage thing for my back workbench a few, mm, few months ago. I said that I was gonna make a, a chisel storage shelf and I'm, you know, 90% there. That, that just needs finishing off, so that's another video. And then we get to electronics. So I've been reading up on electronics for months and Arduino especially, but I've not actually done anything because I didn't have the bits. Anyway, now I do have the bits because I got this Arduino starter kit. So I've shot a video of unboxing that and going through what's what's inside and my first little project which is the hello world of Arduino is to make the LED on board flash um, and after that I've gone on gone a step further which is to do, to make an LED on a breadboard flash so let's just show you that there we go you might think anybody could do that but you probably can't um, so I'm quite proud of that and that will be you know there'll, there'll be a whole strand of videos about the basics of Arduino and the various components the motors the LEDs and um, different sensors and things like that so there we go that's Planet Keith or that will be Planet Keith and you're welcome no passport needed uh, but you do need to subscribe, please. <laughs> so, linky things all over. And I've, I've just changed the address. So now it's youtube.com slash planetkeef. And I'm really looking forward to getting started on these things. So I'll stop talking and get working. See you next time. And that's that. I hope you enjoyed it. Now, please do the usual likes, shares, comments, subscriptions, donations, patronage, all that good stuff, or just some of it. <laughs> and thank you for watching and see you next time.